Welcome back everybody to another video on Black Ops 2. This is part three. And and yeah man, we're just gonna get right back into it. We're playing as oh we're playing as Alex Mason now. I bet. Wait. Triple guns. Blue. I can't figure out what Ninda is without getting inside his fucking head. Salazar, you grew up in Nicaragua during his rise to power. You know his legends better than anyone. Tell me, why does he hate us so much? Tu primera guerra fría. As a boy, he witnessed the country's rape and murder his people. In 1972, there was a colossal earthquake. His family lost everything. A year later, the only thing he ever loved, his sister Josefina, was crippled in a fire. Raul and his father started over, sold drugs for easy money. They became rich, powerful legends of Managua. The Menendez cartel was all but untouchable, so the CIA took out Raul's father in a U.S. sanctioned assassination. Right, so now Menendez fucking hated America and started running guns in Afghanistan for his own private army. CIA got wind of it, went on the hunt for him in Kabul. That was the photo Wood showed us in the vault, remember? See that handsome bastard? That's me. The only one's your father. After Nam. The numbers and all that? I mean, he was one dangerous son of a bitch. <laughs> It's showtime, Mason! Hi, uh, Woods. What'd you see, Woods? Sand. Sand and more fucking sand. That's his contacts <laughs> on his way. You reckon we can trust the Chinese? We can't hear. They've been supporting the Mujahideen, same as us. Hey, glad to see Woods is doing better. They know if Russian was in Afghanistan, they'd be looking at China next. No one likes the Russians, huh? You know me. I don't like anyone. You might want to get your head down. Take it easy, Sal! You deliver the weapons. Now, what about your end of the deal? I will take you to the leader of the Mujahideen. He can help you find Raoul Menendez. We have fresh horses. You will follow. Oh shit. Let's do it. Bet that up, man. Mason, it's Hudson. Did you make contact with Jiao? We're on our way to the Mujahideen camp now. I'm sure I don't need to remind you that our presence here must remain 100% deniable. There will be serious consequences if Russia learns of our involvement in Afghanistan. Yo, that ain't gonna happen. Must hurry. We believe the Soviets are about to launch an attack on the camp. Major, get yeah. up up here! Yeah. This way. I bet. Zao. If a Russian attack is indeed imminent, you're going to need all the help you can get. I've arranged for a couple of specialists to act in an advisory capacity. Here they are now. Ramon, this is Woods and Mason. My two best men. We need weapons, Hudson? not soldiers. <sighs> yeah. 
This should be good. Just so we're clear, we hold off the Russian attack, you give us what you have on Menendez. Our base is here. Any advance will come through one of the narrow passes leading into the valley. I know this. Our men defend these mountains. Our weapons will give them an edge. That's a bullshit plan. You're talking about the Russian army here. They come at you with brute force, which means strength in numbers and heavy armor. Are your men ready for that? They have no experience with the weaponry we brought. And we do. We belong on the front line. The front lines with it? Be gone. Yalla! Yalla! Borobirun! You have faith in your plans, America. I got more than faith, Zhao. Let's rock it. Bro, with us, Zhao. We must hurry! We cannot allow them to enter the valley! Settle up, Mason. history! Fucking A! Oh, I've barely seen that. The, the Mujahideen can handle infantry! Mason, put a credit charge under the archway! Let's make damn sure no more vehicles make it through here. Blow 
it, Mason! He's ready for Zara. Hudson, the west choke point is secure. Armor ain't getting through this way. Woods, Mason, they're throwing everything they have at us. We've got threats all over the valley. Hoosier reporting rushing tanks moving in from the north. Brute's force and strength in numbers? Who expected such a fight? Doesn't mean I wanted it! Tanks are down, Hudson! Scouts report enemy gunships to the north of the valley. Roger that, Hudson. Moving to intercept. Oh, those were friendly. <laughs> The ammo cache is ours. It's the surprise of the American! Mason, return to what base. What kind of problem? problem? Return to base, we just got it. You better see for yourself. One tough son of a bitch. Bet your ass he was. Gravchenko basically carved a hole in his head and he shoved those fucking numbers in there and he survived that. No. <laughs> Mason said he didn't see those numbers anymore, but I don't know. I'm not so sure about that. Mason, better take a look. This isn't over yet. Damn. It's a huge tank. The Russians want to give us one last display of brute force. Let's give them one last display of courage. You with me? Yes, uh, we wish you did.
Where's our bait? <laughs> Oh, it Shit. is Krachenko. Of course he's involved in all this. Krachenko must die. <sighs> Couple times, I saw the tick. And I get that look in his eye, he's scanning the room. <laughs> Next thing you know, he's talking to the Russian. Fucking Reznov. <laughs> Good old Tricky Vic. Woods, maybe I should handle this interrogation. Maybe you stay the fuck out of my way. I got unfinished business with this bastard. <laughs> I left you to rot in Vietnam, Sergeant Woods. You should be dead. Well, nobody told me. Buddy Raman tells me you're doing business with a Nicaraguan named Raul Menendez. What do you do for me? Fuck you! You believe in an eye for an eye? Huh? This is a Mujahideen, baby. They'll bury you up to your neck, right, peel your eyelids out, back, and leave you to fry in the desert. Calm down. So I'll take you resist. out quick. Calm down. Tell Calm me down, about Menendez. I sell him weapons. That doesn't must sound die. too Soviet of you, brother. Calm down, The Soviet Union is I dying. I know he must die, but calm down. Where are the weapons going? Bro, the Cuba. numbers are all around the room. Angola. The third world. Why? Oh, calm down, Mason. Menendez wants to see you. getting harder burn. to calm you down. But that's not gonna happen. Oh. <laughs> more powerful than you know. He even has people in the CIA. Bullshit! <laughs> this guy's fucking with us. The fuck are you doing? Menendez told me you must suffer. You face piece of shit. Wait. We helped you fight the Russians with on your side. No. No, you are and always will be our true enemy. Man, spit on us? Nah, Without you water and shelter, I want you may honey. last a day. If you are strong. Wasn't he one of yours? So, we're in a desert buried the year. Who does your father think rides up on a horse to save us? Tricky Vic. Yeah, see? You're just like your old man. No, it wasn't him. That's not. Come on, if you think it was him, don't you think he would have stuck around for a bit, huh? Maybe explain some shit? Shifting sands. So that's, that looks like that's the end of mission three. So if y'all enjoyed, make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe. And yeah, man, I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.